It's the 9th of July, I'm Jerusha Sukhvia Rath and you're watching News 24 Live. Let's have a look at today's newspaper front pages on the front page of The Times. Judges confront Zuma, judiciary to tackle president on torrent of criticism, including allegations of anti-ANC bias. On the front page of The Business Day, judges take on politicians in rare show of force. We'll discuss criticisms with Zuma and say tensions call for deep reflection. If we move on to the front page of the Burger, here we have the very same story. And again, on the front page of Bilt. On the front page of the Pretoria News, Lotto can roll on, it says, even though judge ruled granting of license illegal. And if we have a look at the front page of the Citizen, court ruling derails Lotto, its business as usual for punters, despite yesterday's decision by the High Court to nullify Ituba's license, casting a cloud of uncertainty across SA. On the front page of the Sowetan initiation death crisis, mobile hospitals have been set up at circumcision hotspots, and 23 young men die, 141 are injured. On the front page of the Star, crime of negligence, here we see, families reel after church findings, and next to that, lottery plays on despite ruling, on the front page of the Herald, more news from the plane crash in East London yesterday. Visit News 24 Live. We've got a video report on exactly what happened. Underneath that, cop in illegal gun shock. On the front page of the Cape Times, victory for exploited debtors. And finally, on the front page of the Cape Argus, business outrage over cycling lanes. Owners say there's no parking for their customers. Well, we'll be keeping you updated on these stories and more. Stay tuned to News 24 Live.